Okie dokie, so <clears throat> I'm about to install one side of the sheet metal. I'm going to put some Loctite and then I'm going to use these screws on the edges and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to end up taking out that window from the inside and drilling holes into the sheet metal and then cutting out you know around the square but also I've been doing some work on this So, I got this, and then I'm going to add a piece of wood, and then put hinges, so it's going to fold this way, and then fold out so I can make a bigger bed. I love it! <clears throat> but anyway... So, it's coming, coming along, coming along. I'll just do a little walk around without tripping, or trying not to trip. So that's it for now. I'm going to try to get this sheet metal up. Wish me luck. Okay, so I got the sheet metal up. And here I was using those screws. And I put the silicone in there. I'm not really sure if I'm going to keep using these screws. I'm not really sure. I might uh, see up here. I used uh, the. Well, I'll show you the screw. I show or I used this screw instead. Ooh, let's see. Focus. Anyway, so I used. Wait, hold on. This screw, I have tons of these screws, and since I'm screwing into um, studs, I was thinking maybe I should just use those. So anyway, so I put this up, and then I drilled out, I took out the window from there, and then I drilled each corner, and I learned this on YouTube. <laughs> And then I drew a line from each, from hole to hole. And then I'm going to end up cutting that out. But in the meantime, I am marking every five inches. Uh, wait, where are you? Every five inches, I'm going to put a screw. And, yeah. So I'm excited. Yeah, I don't know if I want to keep the silver screws on there. I might. I'm not really sure. <clears throat> and then I was thinking, since I have this up, and I only have so much of it, so much of the sheet metal, um, I was thinking of putting the, they have the wood, very thin wood. It goes like this, you know, because this sort of looks like a roof. But then when I'm going down the road, I was just thinking, if I don't secure them well, you know, they'll like flip up or something. I guess I could just make sure to secure them well. But I can have like uh, those or like shingles or something 
right there and then I can have the sheet metal yeah I don't know we'll see I'm going with the flow anyway thanks for watching hey so I got in the hinges for the bed um, Anyways, so I think it actually hits the back there, but I think that's good because then I can hide my bed stuff and maybe I can build something going across here for some seating uh, for, you know, when I don't want my bed stuff to show. Yeah, I don't know. But anyway, whoops, so let me step out, Ooh. I can't wait to get this siding on, because it's in my way, anyway, so yeah, there it is, yay, it's coming along, here's the side, I haven't cut it out yet. But yeah, I think I might change those silver screws out for some darker ones. Anyways. See you later. Hey guys, it's me. Yep. This is my sweaty, sunburn, red face. Um, I've been working all day, <clears throat> but I wanted to show you um, the type of drills, um, the type of tool that I'm using that I absolutely love. Okay, so basically, I got myself the Black & Decker Matrix, and of course, it's got to be quartered. I cannot deal with recharging my batteries all the time, but I love this drill because this is how I'm going to cut out my window right there, right there, right there. <laughs> um, is with this so basically it comes off and then basically it's just this and today I've already used the regular part of the drill it just snaps right on and then I've also used the circular saw. I love it. So, uh, yeah, so I have the circular saw. I actually, I also have a impact head um, as well. And I use that for a lot of my tougher screws and <clears throat> Um, when I change my tires and rotate my tires and stuff like that but um, yeah this is my baby I love it um, again it's called the Black & Decker Matrix I wonder if that's gonna be backwards on your side that is just so weird huh. anyway Black & Decker so I'm excited to be um, working on this this weekend. Um, I hurt my back and so I saw a chiropractor for the first time and it's been helping a little bit and I've been trying to rest and everything. Ugh, here comes a dreaded mosquito. Ugh, I hate mosquitoes. Anyway, um, 
yeah so that was a little tour of my one of my this is my main tool that I've been using um, so okay bye